Hey there, Smite fans, and welcome back to another prediction video. This one's going to be for week five of the Oceanic Pro League. This one's going to be very fun because we got to see some interesting matches last week. I got one of them wrong, Avant-Garde, not quite playing up to exception. And honestly, I think actually really Noxide kind of coming out of nowhere and being able to play a little bit better than I expected. I'm going to be honest. I was kind of doubting them and they were able to come out on top. Uh, of one game against avant-garde and moving into this week i mean it's going to be great we have four games really to cover and the very first one's going to be legacy versus dark sided so this is something i was kind of talking about last week where there's kind of a a split of the teams right now Direwolves are on top then it's legacy then dark sided then avant-garde then kanga then noxide that's really kind of the listing we have for oceana and right now I think this is where Darksided can prove themselves. This is the kind of opportunity that they want to be able to push themselves forward, try to come out on top of a game against Legacy. That being said, I think Legacy still has a leg up, and I think that they should be able to kind of take down Darksided. They should be close games, but I expect to see Legacy come out with a 2-0. Any other team, after seeing Noxide last week, any other team, I would probably say, okay, they might have a chance. They might be able to get a game off of this. Not against Direwolves. Again, they are on a whole different planet. I've said that every week, and I think I'm going to continue saying that as long as they go without a loss. 12-0 and right now in the league. And if Legacy wasn't able to take them down last week, I just can't see Noxide finding it this week unless Direwolves make a huge mistake, which I just can't see happening. Noxide is going to get knocked down here. Another 2-0, really, in favor of Direwolves. So while we're talking about things that should go one way or the other, this one's going to be very, very difficult, just because Avant-Garde was playing, again, they played really well two weeks ago. Last week it was really good, and then we saw Noxide kind of come up, and so Kanga have a good opportunity here. In fact, if they're going to find a win against Avant-Garde, this is their chance to do it, especially since Noxide was able to do it. I feel like Kanga, if they do their homework, should be able to find that one. That being said, so far, it doesn't seem like they have found that footing quite yet, and I expect to see Avant-Garde come out with this one with a 2-0 on top. Again, it kind of falls down to what exactly Kanga does in-game, but just looking at them, just the way they've been playing, I expect to see Avant-Garde come out on top. We saw it last week. We'll see it again this week. Legacy versus Direwolves. I expect to see Direwolves again come out on top. This will be, I think, making them 16-0 with these two wins and the two I gave them earlier this week. As much as I like Legacy, as much as Legacy has played very, very well, I just do not see them really being able to take down Direwolves again. It's the kind of tier. I mentioned those two teams being at the top, but really Direwolves is the one kind of stomping down on everyone. I expect to see them go up even higher. And once again, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. This is a really, really quick video, really, just kind of covering OPL four matches this week. Again, Saturday, 2 a.m. to 3.30 a.m., and then Sunday at 2 a.m. and 3.30 a.m. Be sure to tune into those if you can. If not, watch the VODs. These teams are actually really good. And, of course, watching Direwolves play is a wonderful pleasure. And really, it's going to be interesting. I mean, they've got uh, two more weeks really going for them right here. And I feel like we're starting to see the end of where we're going to see these teams end up. So I'd once again just like to thank you guys for watching. And I'll talk to you in the next prediction video.